Hello, everyone. Thanks so much for logging on to CBSDenver.com. We are here at the View House Centennial hanging out with Broncos linebacker Brandon Marshall. He was our guest tonight at X on Xfinity Monday Live. We ended the show talking about your index finger and yeah. what you said was one of the mo worst moments of, of your career. Have you seen anybody else's weird fingers? Um, yeah, Virgil Green, actually, he has like the top of his ring finger that he puts his wedding ring on. This goes this way. So <laughs> the, the tip of his finger slants this way. Okay. So it's, it's weird. Do you ever see Tory Holt? No, I've never seen Tory Holt. Tory Holt has a really, yeah. really weird finger. Yeah, we're going to have to look that up and show it to you. Michael Strahan can actually bend one of his fingers. Oh my God. Can you do any no, you I can't party do any tricks bending. or anything? I, I, none of that. <laughs> so is it stiff? I mean. Yeah, stiff. So I had four surgeries on this thing. That's why it's terrible. Four and, surgeries. Um, so I had the arthritis was so bad, they had to. Uh, put metal on it, you know what I'm saying, to, to keep it from moving. So now it's it's stuck like this forever. When I make a fist, the finger kind of goes okay. like that. And, so. of course, this was because of the tackle you made in the Chiefs game back in 2015 yeah. against Jamal Charles, who ended up being your a teammate. teammate absolutely. Did he at least pay for the surgery or anything? <laughs> <laughs> no, I talked to him about it, though, man. He had much to say because he was upset, right, Of course he was. That <laughs> was a big reasons. fumble on his <laughs> yeah, part definitely. that uh, helped you guys end up winning that game. Uh, okay, let's talk about this week and just kind of y'all's mindset yeah. heading into a big game against the Rams. You guys have lost three straight games. Where is this team mentally right now? You know what? I would say we're desperate. We're a desperate team, but I don't want us to, to push and be desperate to where we're doing things outside of what we're coached to do, you know? So, yes, we could be desperate, and yes, we could, you know, we know it's a must win. We have to win this game. We would like to win this game. So let's not push and do something outside of us that we didn't work on all week. Let's just do the little things and do them better. Take the little things, do them better. Um, you know, whatever we, whatever our assignment is, just do it harder. You know, do it better, man, with more intensity. So I hope we can uh, can do that this week. Knowing that the Rams come in with one of the top offenses in the NFL, they're 5-0 and undefeated. Yeah. Can that bring you guys together a little bit opposed to playing a team that was maybe winless or just had one win on the season? Absolutely, man. You know, we get up for, for big games just like we did for the Chiefs. You know, that's a game that we should have won. <laughs> we should have won that game. But, you know, we, I think everybody gets up for these big games. So, um, you know, I hope we take this challenge, man, and, and we take it to heart and, and, and we actually uh, respond. Is that is it kind of weird that you guys were able to get up for the Chiefs and then maybe fell flat in New York? Yeah, You know what? It, it is weird, you know. Um, I don't want to make excuses, you know, um, about the short week and how we traveled east, but, <laughs> you know. Early start time, yeah, <laughs> you know, yeah. Uh, I don't want to make excuses, <laughs> but uh, it is weird, absolutely. Okay, we will leave it at that. <laughs> um, you, in, in your season right now, where can you go to, to maybe take the next step? What's the next step for Brandon Marshall? Yeah, well, the next step for me is, is I'm trying to get 100% healthy. You know, I've been playing these last five games, uh, really last four games, I'll say, uh, probably like 75 80 percent but you know me wanting to be out there for my teammates and mm -hmm. um you know wanting to be the guy you know i've been out there i just haven't been able to execute like i like i usually have or like i want to um you know my my knee is you know it's at a bad place right now but you know what you know i'm, I'm gonna try to be uh, better for this team um, you know, whether, you know, have to take a step back or not. So, you know, we'll see. Well, hey, man, we wish you the best of health. You're a great guest tonight. I know it's not appreciate easy coming yeah. in and doing these shows after a day like yesterday, but you're always a great guest, Absolutely. and we appreciate that appreciate so that. much. And thank you for logging on to CBSDenver.com.